I hate my husband and I am so tempted to cheat on him. Everything is overwhelming. My husband, 36M, and I, 35F, have been married for 12 years. We have two daughters, but there has never been a spark between us. It's an arranged marriage and we have absolutely nothing in common. In the beginning, he was tolerable, except he never prioritized me. His parents live with us, which is common in India. A few years ago, I found out that he used all our savings recklessly in the stock market. He lost all our savings and borrowed lakhs of rupees from his friends, losing that money too. When his friends confronted him to pay them back, he came to me. I sold all my jewelry, about 25 sovereigns of 22k gold, we sold our home, took out loans, borrowed money from my parents, and paid his friends back. Even before this happened, I addressed how he was not being a supportive partner. I was the only one taking care of all the chores, cooking for everyone, including his parents, cleaning the home, and taking care of our kids' studies while having a full-time job. He never contributed to anything and was never emotionally supportive. He always made fun of my looks, my teeth are a little crooked, and I'm short, which made me self-conscious to the point where I stopped smiling or laughing because I didn't want my teeth to show. Though I know I'm moderately attractive, not hearing it from my husband makes me feel terrible. Before I gave him my savings and jewelry, I made it very clear how he made me feel and how he was not being emotionally supportive. I also told him I wanted us to go to couples therapy. He promised to prioritize me and agreed to therapy. Everything was fine for a few weeks, but whenever I brought up therapy, he changed the subject. Eventually, we never went to therapy, and his pattern of emotional abuse resumed. He also started to beat me. When I told my parents about it, they simply asked me to adjust. His parents are of no use either. In these years, I paid my parents back, finished the loans by doing three jobs, several side hustles, and freelancing for a couple of years. I also saved up some more money, bought some gold, and concentrated on my career and kids as my relationship with him hit rock bottom. I gave up on it altogether. From time to time, I've told him that his lack of attention is making me feel attracted to anyone who gives me even the tiniest bit of attention. I've practically begged him for hugs and kisses and to take me on dates, not even fancy ones, as they'd be expensive, even a homemade tea on the terrace in the moonlight would be enough for me. He has never done any of it. Recently, he borrowed about six Indian rupees locks from a high-interest broker and invested it in a fraudulent scheme, losing all the money. He again came back to me when things went wrong, and we sold all my jewelry again, used all my savings, and borrowed from my sister and parents. Divorce separation is not an option as it costs locks and a lot of time, both of which I don't have. I also don't have anyone to support me financially if I quit my job to take care of my kids. If I go to work, there will be no one to take care of my kids. There's a friend who is being flirtatious with me, and I'm so tempted to reciprocate. I don't know what to do.